Hi everyone. Hi Dr. Ram. Hi Pankaj ji. Hello everyone. We'll wait for we'll wait for two more minutes, Dr. Ram, and then we'll kick start. We can. We can. All right. Just in the interest of time, uh, we'll kick start. Uh, just to make sure that everybody uh, joins in over a period of time as we kick start and as we go along. Uh, Welcome, guys. Uh, I a very warm welcome to all of you uh, for joining uh, joining the webinar. Uh, this is gonna be, uh, I would say, uh, a very uh, perfect one for anyone and everyone who wants to or who is looking forward for pursuing a global career, because what we'll be discussing what we'll be discussing today uh, would be certainly be helpful from you to know and understand what the uh, the world is looking at from the finance standpoint. And in that regard, what we have in store today is one of the curriculum that uh, Loyola has introduced, which we really want to talk on in terms of, you know, what uh, it can be for you and what you can really gain out of it. Um, to have with me uh, and to discuss this, I have with me my uh, esteemed, uh, uh, I would say, panelist, if not anything else, <laughs> Dr. Ram with me from, from Liba. Uh, and Dr. Ram, maybe just an intro from you and then we'll kick start. Yeah. Hi. Good evening. Can you guys, you know, please return your videos so that it, uh, it can be an interaction. Okay. Instead of, you know, a monotone dialogue from us. Okay. It will be great if you switch on videos. Yeah. Thank you, Akash. Deepin, is it possible? Mansi. Yeah. Thank you, Deepin. Mansi. And then uh, Isha Parigar. Yeah. It is it will be great if you guys can switch on your videos. Okay. Shruti also, if possible, okay, if you're in this situation. See, this program is, you know, Pankaj sir is sitting at Delhi. Okay. And I am at, you know, actually my you know, working level is at Chennai, but I am in my hometown now. Uh in my Lord, right? It's a rural area. Okay. Uh, so in my hometown, I'm sitting there and then, you know, you guys may be from various parts of India, okay? And then we are connecting here. That is the beauty of the program, okay? It is hybrid also. There will be three campus immersions. You will be coming to the campus. All the things are there. But, you know, as it is online, we will, you know, we will give you best and best of the resources in terms of faculties, in terms of corporate experiences, okay? In terms of CPAs, trained CPAs. That's the beauty of this program, okay? Well, there is a collaboration between Baker and Liba. Okay, Baker is synonymous with uh, you know CP education for more than hundred years, and uh, Lyla is a brand you know big brand, one of the top five colleges in the country. Okay, uh, started in nineteen twenty four. This is our hundredth year. Okay, so two institutions having more than hundred plus years of existence. Okay, joined together along with Pintram. Okay, our partner in execution. Okay, so we are launching this program. So, you know, that is the beauty of this online mode of education. Okay, it's not possible in the physical. And that's going to be the way forward. Okay, uh, so, yeah, we will see. So, Pankaj sir will talk more about it. Then we will you know, talk more in the FAQs. Okay. Sure. Thank okay. you, Dr. Ram. Thanks, thanks for the intro. Uh, what we have in store today is that we'll be going through, uh, I would say, a couple of the slides. Uh, in terms of getting and making a deep dive into the program as to what this program really entails for us. While we do that, what we really want all of you to really uh, keep doing, if you can, is that uh, if there is any question that really comes into your mind, query that really comes onto your mind, do uh, just uh, put it on a chat and we'll be certainly taking this up towards the end. The intention of this program and the intention of this another 45 minutes of time that we have together is to make sure that, if not anything, we should be able to make you more educated and more informed in terms of taking your next steps forward. So that is the intent and that's what we'll, we'll try to strive and, and work throughout, wherein we can certainly make you more equipped in terms of taking the right decision for yourself. And of course, uh, getting on to the conclusion as to what should be your next best move. With that, I'll quickly jump on and and move on into the into the introduction. Who who doesn't know Liba? Liba is... is is, is somewhat somewhere, I'm sure most of you know it, most of you relish it, most of you dream it, most of you really want to get into it. And, and so does me for that matter. You know, why would anybody not want to be part of Liba when we know that the kind of commitment, the kind of response, the kind of uh, 
uh, I would say, value that Libra brings on to the to the alumni, and that is the reason you know why I'll you know I'll probably uh, just give you a glimpse of it in terms of you know what Libra is. Libra is as as Dr. Ram really mentioned, uh, is a premier B schools of of India and of course the globe. Uh, established since 1979, we we all uh, would not have been born by that time. At least I I, I did, of course. Uh, Levi is committed to the form uh, in in whatsoever shape and format, and has been the the pillar behind various committed leaders around the world. There is a, there is there are I would say there are many names that you would see uh, who have done wonders, be it politics, be it. Uh, in you know, from the industry standpoint, be it from the standpoint of they being adding value as an academician, be it from the standpoint of they being the the I would say the culture carriers around the world, Libra has been a strong pillar behind them because most of them have been the Libra alumni, and that is one of the reasons why corporates and industry really relishes anybody and everybody who come from Libra because they carry that. Uh, legacy behind them in terms of you know what re Libra really brings onto the table. Libra is managed by G suits of Loyola College Society, and uh, I'm, I don't think that needs any introduction because it is very well known for the contribution that that is being happening to the senior or a higher or a professional education, as we may want to call it. Important piece is that uh, knowing the uh, the institution where you join is is the super super I would say supreme is of supreme importance because you really be investing your time and money onto it. So having the choosing the right I would say organization or institution is of supreme importance, and that's where Libra really stands apart from anyone and everyone in the world. If you really talk on about the program, I think that's. That's something uh, uh, Dr. Ram briefly touched upon, but I'll probably do a deep dive into it. Uh, this is one of the programs and not any and every one uh, offers this kind of a benefit, but, but this is one of the program that was created uh, basis the industry demand. So we have always seen, and we'll I'll come on to the slide wherein I want to ask uh, about, uh, and I'll ask myself and of course yourself as to why this program. But this was a program that was being structured last year uh, after considering the need of the industry that we have been observing wherein people are looking forward for the folks who have done uh, and have the edge in the administration, the MBA, and at the same time, they have an edge in terms of accounting or the finance at large. So we so this program got into the picture. It got both, you know, born that point in time. Uh, it offers the dual qualification, but because it, you you would get the postgraduate degree, um, you know, postgraduate. I would say it, it it is more of a postgraduate program from the from the international in the international finance, and alongside you would get the certified public accountant as a qualification from US, which is being offered by American Institute of Certified Public Accountants. It's an eleven month postgraduate program and. Uh, uh, there is a lot that you'll be learning in these 11 months, which is something to be relished because you would not only touch upon the theory in the, into the curriculum, but this actually equips you uh, by putting in various, um, I would say, knowledge areas or the guidance that you really need for, for really uh, getting into any and every company in the finance sector. The kind of uh, curriculum that we have been able to, uh, you know, able to get out of this program is that on one side you would be trained and skilled on the management skills and the technological changes that are happening or the innovations that are happening in the in the world of finance, and at the same time you would be able to grab one of the most sought after qualification, which is certified public accountant of US. Uh, to give a perspective about CPA, I'm I'm professionally myself a CPA, so I can I can really vouch for it. The kind of value that CPA really brings on to the table for any of the folks who've done CPA is huge, because this is one of the qualification that is not only demanded in US, but across the globe. Because considering it's a US certified, I would say qualification, it has demand around the world for anybody and everybody who has to deal with anything in US. So most of the Indian companies, be it Wipro, Infosys, TCS, or the big fours, or the companies like Unilever's of the world, they all understand CPA and they really want CPA to work for them because they somewhat somewhere have something in relation to the same, which they really need to deliver from the US compliance standpoint. The program, as Dr. Ram mentioned, would be delivered in the blended mode. 
uh, what, what do you mean by blended mode? Blended mode is more to do with the fact that you would not only get the, the live online sessions, but you would also get the various various campus immersions to be part of Liba, I would say, uh, college, Liba program, Liba campus. You will be part of that, uh, those immersions, and you will be part of the learnings that we would do, uh, be it peer-to-peer -peer learning or be it getting some kind of um, extra edge from the expert Liba faculties face-to-face. -face. Now, why this program? I, I did briefly touch upon that, but one thing that I really want to be talking on and, and stressing on is that why this program was born is to do with the fact that many of the folks in the industry or many of the companies in the industry are looking forward for the folks who are not only having experience in accounting, but also on the management side of it. So what generally happens is that they hire MBAs and then they want them to be trained on accounting or they hire accountants and then they want to be trained on the administration side of it. So this program actually offers the best of the both worlds. So what happens is that in the 11 months of time, while you would do a curriculum that would certainly entail you to have a PGP from LIBA as far as the overall uh, program is concerned, but on the other side, you would get the most, one of the most esteemed qualifications of the world, which is CPA. So it's a dual qualification program being very much integrated and, and jointly packed as one program, which is what makes this program very much different from any of the other programs in the market. Now, some of the program benefits which you, which all of us should know is that this, this program actually uh, uh, gives you an entry into the world of LIBA without appearing for CAT, which is a big thing. But that doesn't mean that your, 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 your journey gonna be easy because there is certainly a selection uh, criteria you would have to fill in your uh, uh, form for application. You have to give the SOP in terms of why do you think this program would be helpful to you. And once we have gone through that SOP, then there are uh, there is a round of interview that happens, the group discussion kind of a thing. And once that happens, then the selection is finally being made for the folks who can join these programs. Not anyone and everyone would be permitted. We only need the serious guys who wants to take their career to a very different level, like what happened for anybody and everybody who is a LIBA alumni. So we really want the serious folks who wants to take career to the level which they, they aspire for, and they're ready to really be, um, be with us in terms of uh, taking their, their career to those levels. Only those are the folks we are really looking forward to. As I said, it's a dual qualification program. PGP comes from LIBA and USCPA comes from AICPA. Uh, uh, it is an 11 month program offering both the skills and various skills, I would say, that are industry oriented and needed by global MNCs around the world. Considering that there is a huge demand of CPA professionals around the world and in India, it actually leads on to a very, um, I would say, uh, in, a, in a very different position for yourself so that um, you can get placed in any and every uh, giant or the big MNCs of the world because the kind of job opportunities that comes once you have done the CPA is huge, is humongous in terms of the 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 content or the or the, the need that that you would have for yourself when it comes to the industry. Campus immersions are certainly the lifetime experiences that this program really offers, which is something to be relished, my friend. When you get into Liba campus and be part of the the class over there, when you study over there, when you when you've gone through uh, and, and when you'll meet the, the veterans of LIBA in terms of faculties, in terms of people who have been alumni over there, the kind of experiences that you gain, the kind of network that you have is huge, which is something not, uh, that, that is something not, that, that is something that will not end by the end of this course, but that is something that you would carry as a legacy all throughout your life. You would get also you will also get the job placement assistance in this program, and we'll be certainly helping you in terms of uh, once you have done the PGP and done the CPA, we'll be certainly helping you with with all that support that you would need in terms of getting placed. And guess what? The icing on the cake is that once you have done the course, you you will get the LIBA alumni status, which is huge in itself. Coming on to the program and the credits that this this uh, program has for you this program actually is an 11 month program approximately 44 weeks 45 weeks 
that will give you 39 credits and uh, the CPA training, of course, would be over and above that. Number of terms are four. And of course, you would get three campus uh, immersions, which will certainly help you on the peer-to-peer -peer learning. And I would say various live LIBA course experiences that you would carry for yourself. Now, eligibility, which is a big thing. And many of the folks, they really want to understand this as to what the eligibility of the program is. The eligibility of this program, while we do not have a CAT need over here, we have minimum eligibility of somebody to be a BCom or a BBA in finance or and postgraduate in the field of commerce, be it an MCOM, MBA, and, and, and so on and so forth, that will work. Or if you have a professional qualification, even if you're not fully qualified, if you have CA inter, CMA inter, all of that would help in terms of getting yourself qualified this, for this program. This program actually uh, is a big time advantage for anyone who is a BCom, BCom guy, because if you do not even have any other qualification, you can still pursue this program because this program gives you the requisite credit, considering it is being approved by NASBA, it actually gives you the credit that you really need for the purpose of appearing for the CPA exam, which you would otherwise would not be able to. But if you join this program, then you automatically becomes eligible for it, which is a huge, huge win for you. Now, coming on to fees, right? This is really important for anyone who is thinking about and of course wanting to get enrolled. The fee of this program, if you get selected, and again, I'm just quoting and unquoting this, if you get selected, because there is a selection process that really works behind you getting selected for the program, which I said, as I said, is going to be you filling in the form and having filled your SOP. Your SOP will be reviewed by expert professionals. And once we have done that, then we will be calling you for the interview. And that will be sort of an interview and a group discussion kinds. And once you have shortlisted there, then the offer would be made and then you would proceed accordingly. The fee of the program is 5.95 lakhs, including GST, which is an introductory price. Um, this is going to be very different next year. But considering that, you know, we really want to be working out uh, in terms of helping the students uh, to pursue this the introductory price has been decided. The fee includes all the cost of the textbooks, reading materials, and library resources that will be offered to you. However, there are a few exclusions from it that you should certainly know that there is a there is a campus immersion uh, uh, that will that'll be there in this program. The cost of travel and the related cost of staying uh, uh, would, be, would be excluded. And from the CPA standpoint, the evaluation of CPA and registration and examination fees is excluded, which is approximately 2.5 lakhs of rupees. If I really go ahead, uh, we are now reaching on to the stage wherein I would really want and ask you to ask any question that anyone may have. Dr. Ram is here. I'm here any which ways uh, to help you get the answers of the queries that you may have and to help you take the right decision for yourself. So any question anyone has, I'll be more than happy to pick it up and try answering that. Feel free, guys. Uh, you can chat, you can uh, type it in the chat box, feel free. Uh, this is your time. You probably need to, any understanding that you may need from the standpoint of uh, doing or giving a best shot to this, this course, this is the time to really ask for that. I've given over here the call uh, and the WhatsApp details to who you can reach out to in case you're interested. But as, as on date, anything that you would want to ask us, I'll be more than happy to, uh, or Dr. Ram would be more than happy to really help you out with. Anybody? Athira, Dipin, Eva, anything anybody want to ask? Akash, please go ahead, Akash, and it, speak up. Sir, good evening, sir. Good evening. Sir, actually, currently I'm doing USCMA now. So I'm taking one year break after finishing my third year PCOM. So how efficient it will be with the USCMA and CPA with the IFPM? Sorry, repeat your question. How? Uh, uh, how efficient it will be having your CMA and your CPA? Efficient is a function of, you know, how how do you want to do it? I, I, I would rather ask it in a way, I'll probably rephrase your question, saying that, is it worthwhile doing US CMA and US CPA together? Is that something that you would want to understand, Akash? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So 
I would say there are there are two different stream, Akash. USCM is a very different stream, and USCPA is a very different stream. If I really give you the parallels as as compared to how it 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 is being uh, taken up in India, USCMA is more of an ICW in India, and uh, uh, USCPA is more like a CA in India, Chartered Accountants in India. But the qualification, both the qualification is of US. So effectively, you become a cost accountant of US once you have done the CMA, and effectively, you become a Chartered Accountant of US when you do CA. So. I would say from the curriculum standpoint uh, or the uh, recognition standpoint, both are different. Now, coming on to curriculums, many of the areas that you would learn in CMA, uh, be it on the cost front or be it on the financial management front, uh, all of those areas are somewhat somewhere there in the CPA curriculum. They are there. They're already there. So that will be an edge or an advantage to you because you would have already seen those areas. However, considering CPA is, in, uh, is a more generic and a wider uh, qualification, you would be learning various things in CPA which is not there in CMA. For example, you'll be learning financial reporting, which is US GAAP. You'll be learning auditing, which is US GAS. You'll be learning uh, regulation, which is US taxation. All of that is not there in USCMA. So from the curriculum standpoint, it is it will be it will be more than what you would be learning in CMA. But of course, since you're doing CMA, uh, various areas that you've covered in CMA would be helpful for you because all of those areas, somewhat somewhere, would be included in some shape or format in CPA too. Does that help, Akash? Yes, sir. One thing that I really want to call out over here, Akash, you know, and this is something to be to be to be aware of. Considering, and I'm sure by now you would have seen, considering ICWA when it get compared to CA, the demand of ICWA is less than CA because CA is more widely accepted. Considering CA can work in any industry and in any role, however, CMAs have or the ICWs have the restriction of working in particular roles and jobs, the same thing persists and same thing is there as far as US CMA and US CPA is concerned. US CMA has sort of some specific areas and the lines and the companies who you would work for. However, US CPA has very large acceptability, hence wider audience to hire you. Is that clear, Akash, just from my understanding? Yes, sir. Clear, sir. All right. And of course, over and above that, when LIBA offers you the PGP, your value goes multifold. I'm sure you understand that. Yeah, sure. Sir. Definitely, I will go through it. Yeah. Anybody else, guys? Anything? Feel free, guys. This is your time. Exhale out any doubt that you may have. You are going to be investing in your career, right? You have to have to take the right decision for yourself. Speak up if there is anything we can help you out with. Dipen, Jendran, Athira. Hello, sir. Sir, I am Dipen, sir. Yeah, Dipen. Sir, I am completed by BCom in uh, 2021, sir. Okay. And I have, after that, I am pursuing CMA, CMA till now, sir. Till now, I not yet uh, get to clear the CMA inter, sir. Whether CMA it... Indian CMA, CMA or... inter, sir. Indian CMS, India CMS. Sir. Okay, okay. Whether this uh, uh, this course can uh, can helpful helpful for my career for career, sir. See, I tell you, and this is something which you should certainly know and understand, uh, pen The problem with with CMA or with CA is not that that they are extremely difficult. But the problem is the way they are being structured makes it difficult. For example, in CMA, you when you give inter, you have to clear all the exams together, make 15 total, have 14 all the subjects, which at times becomes a challenge because Dipin may have done good in two of the subjects and may not have been done that beautifully in one of the subjects. However, since group is considered, Dipin is not able to clear that particular group. 
Is that is that clear, Dipin? Is that the yes, case? Sir. Sure, right? Yes, sir. However, in US CPA, what happens is that you only appear for one exam at a time. You do not have to give a group group over there. And that is the reason why Indians have very nice results in terms of clearing the CPA. So let's say you will prepare for financial accounting and reporting first, and then you'll give the exam. After that, you'll start preparing for audit and then you'll give your exam. And after that, you'll start preparing for tax and then you'll give your exam. So effectively, imagine the pen, you spending five months, six months on four subjects. In, you know, in relation to that or in contrast to it, you spending three to four months on one subject. Where do you think you would have better possibility to clear? Three to four months in one subject, sir. Absolutely. That makes this curriculum achievable. I'll not say it is easy. I would never say CPA is easy, but considering that it gives you a very different level of flexibility, it becomes easier for the student to clear it. And demand, I'm sure, you know, if you type on Google the jobs for US CPA, you'll be astonished in terms of the jobs that they have. Okay, sir. Now, Shruti is asking which is better to choose MBA or this course? Dr. Ram, do you want to give it a try? Yes, Pankajji. So, what's the question? MBA which, or this course? Which is okay. better to choose MBA or this course? What should you what you want to choose? Finance or marketing or HR and MBA you want to choose? That is a question you have to you know. If you want to choose MBA finance, okay, then this course is better than MBA finance. Okay, that's what you know. We will tell you. Okay, why it is better than MBA finance because. See, the problem with this PGDM guys, IAM guys, okay, or LIBA guys who are PGDM, okay, or MBA, is the depth knowledge of uh, accounting professional won't be there, okay? Most of these guys are engineering guys are become also, the level of depth that you are going to touch in CPA won't be covered, okay? Yeah, you know, finance starts from, finance is the, accounting is the basis for finance, okay? Finance starts from where accounting is. So we have, we will build financial foundation, you know, knowledge. Uh, the castle will be very beautiful, but the foundation is shaky. Okay. So, you know, but here in this course, it is a combination of blending of both, you know, uh, fundamental will be very strong. Accounting knowledge will be very strong. You will get an international, you know, recognized, you know, uh, certification. And then on, on the top of that, we will build the finance castle. Okay. So that it will take you straightly you know, to the mid-level or the top-level you know, finance jobs, okay? So that is the beauty of this program. So MBA, if you are going for marketing, if you want to be a marketing guy, then this course is not for you, okay? If you want to do, do your specialization, okay, then this is not for you. But if you are going to choose MBA finance, it, this is better than MBA finance, okay? In terms of learning, okay? You know, so I'll you add one thing to that, Shruti, and thanks, Dr. Ram, for really taking that in depth. But one thing I really want to add to this, which is at the end of the day, my friend, what is the reason of doing an MBA or any course for that matter? The reason is that you should be able to get in the demand. Now you tell me, you doing an MBA and you doing a course which gives you a dual qualification, which is a PGP from LIBA and of course a CPA from US. Do you think that a single qualification versus the dual qualification, which one have the weight? Of course, the dual qualification, right? And that too, when one of the qualification is US-based. So answer is, is actually pretty clear that when you have a choice of getting an, you know sort of a PGP from an organization like LIBA and to get uh, a, a qualification like CPA, you would have a better possibility or a better chance to crack various organizations around the world, which is a big time thing. Athira is saying, is it easy to get a job after PGPIF course? I would say, Athira, I don't have to say this, but you just go and Google out the jobs after US CPA. You'll be astonished, my friend. The minimum starting salary for anybody who has done CPA uh, and of course, Liba is a, will be an icing on the cake uh, if you know if you join this course because both of them will do wonders for you. But the starting salary of any qualified CPA starts from you know at least eight lakhs, and it can go to any level. So it's huge in terms of 
the salary that you can expect if you have you know done something like this yeah adding to the uh Pankaj, the thing is you know why this blended program Pankaj are also you know rightly told uh, that this is, you know, in the why the program slide, that why this program is that, okay? Adding to that, you see, accounting knowledge is beautiful. It's a beautiful profession, okay? Uh, but uh, except a few, like, uh, you know, Pankaj sir, okay, who went on uh, to the helm of the finance profession, simply with the CA and CPA, okay? Uh, there are quite a few, but not many, okay, are able to excel just because of the, the way the programs has been structured. Okay, what is the problem with this programs? See, you will be like a what to say, techie, okay, in accounting, accounting techie or bookkeeping techie, okay. There won't be any human interaction, you will study and you will pass, okay. That is the kind of structure. All this CA, CMA, okay, I, I am a CMA professional and I did my MBA finance also. What is the difference between the B school curriculum and then this accounting profession curriculum? In B school, you know, accounting profession curriculums, CPA and everything, there will be a syllabus you have to complete and you have to attend the test and you will pass. Okay. But what is a B school curriculum? It is entirely different where, you know, presentations will be there, group discussions will be there, case simulations will be there, hands-on experience will be there, project will be there. Okay. So that there will be a human element, business element, and then human touch. Okay. That is essentially preparing you for the leadership role. Okay, that is the beauty of this program that knowledge is there. Okay, but with knowledge, you will also learn people skills, business skills, and leadership skills. Okay, that is the graduate attitudes. Okay, the accounting professions will have the technical skills, only very few cases, exceptions. Okay, as I said, Pankaj sir will have the leadership skill also. Okay, Pankaj sir is also an excellent marketer. Okay, I don't know by birth, but uh, you know, but rarely. Uh, this, uh, you know, things will come out. For many, it is not so. Okay. So that, you know, that is the beauty of this program where we will build, you know, technical skills will be there on top of that leadership skills and business skills will also be there. Okay. So definitely, you know, uh, if you really learn, then people must come after you. Okay. That is. Anything else, guys, that you would want to ask? You want to please feel free, guys. As I said, this is your time. You know, we you, you have to take a big time decision of your life. So you have to be doubly, triply sure in terms of what is your next step, uh, and that is something you should you should certainly certainly you know ask. I would say one one biggest advantage is is and I I personally feel that to be a big one for you is that there is no entrance test per se for this program. While there is a process that we will follow, but there is no CAT or a MAT or a GMAT kind of a thing that you really need to follow, which is a big thing to get into an organization like LIBA. And which is something I would say uh, to be taken up very positively by anyone. Anything, guys? Anyone? Dipin, anything that you I have? saw. Hello? I saw. Yes. I'm Jendran. Yes, Jinendra, Boli. Ah, uh, yes, sir. So actually, I want to know because you're connecting PGM goals for one year, which is a working profession kind of person. Because I'm a working profession, after my completion of become, I'm working as a junior accountant. Right now, I need to in, in go through my career to forward. I need to forward my career. So while I'm pursuing this PGM, it will be rather difficult because become as a basic, I know. But however, it's too difficult to complete PGM this course as well as uh, like Liba has offering another course like uh, in a two years working profession can also attend MBA in Saturday Sundays like that they are offering which is will be a more beneficial so. Jinedra, you know one thing I, I I must say and this is something you should always have with you always all throughout your life. You will not get heaven, my friend, till the time you'll die. Do not forget that. If yeah, you want yeah. heaven, you have to die. Otherwise, you'll be you'll be you'll be in the hell, uh, like all of us are. That is the beauty. It is absolutely right that a year course doing a dual qualification is certainly not gonna be easy. Certainly not. But my friend, people who are doing this are like us only. People who are doing this are working professionals only. 
and they do it. And whosoever can do it will have or will craft his future accordingly. Now, one way to look at it is that it will gonna be it's gonna be really difficult. So I don't know if I'll be able to do it. The another way to look at it is it's gonna be difficult. So most of the folks would not be able to do it, but I'll do it and I'll get the best of it. Choice is yours, my friend. Which way you want to decide? Okay, sir, definitely. I will choose on what is best. Thank you for that. The only thing I would leave you with is that when you compare this with a weekend MBA kind of a thing, do not forget that weekend MBA will only give you one qualification. This would give you two qualifications, one coming from US, which is a big thing. See, it is quite simple, okay? Less money, less tension, more money, more tension. Life is simple, okay? You aspire for less money, less salary, take less tension, okay? If your aspiration is, you know, too big, then, you know, you have to take more tension, okay? Not that we all have to go to heaven right now, my friend. Don't worry. We'll, time will come when we'll, we'll all will go. <laughs> On a lighter note. <laughs> All right. Any, anybody else, guys? Anything? Raja, Sujit, Ringel, Athira, Eva. I see beautiful names here, but people are not talking. What? Sir? Yes, Sujit. Sir, after completion of this course, uh, can I get job immediately? See, if you have completed the course, and as in, you know, both the uh, both the areas have been completed, the CP as well as your PGP. Uh, your you know you would certainly get a job. As I said, you know you should go and Google out the jobs that that we have for you know CP. I can tell you, and we deal with uh, this day in and day out. We have more jobs available than CP qualified candidates being available at this point in time. We have more jobs, so demand is more than the supply. I'm sure you know you understand the the uh, the fundamentals of economics what happens when demand is more and supply is less price increase right that is the reason salaries are also increasing on this front okay sir and another one the same sir yeah what is the difficulty difficult level of this course sir it's difficult my friend it's difficult that is that is what I would say. It is difficult. See, if the program is not difficult, Sujit, then you would not have a demand for it. If CA would not have been difficult, why CA would get a salary? If CPA is not difficult, why would CPA get a salary? BCom is easy, right? That is the reason BCom doesn't get a salary in the market. So yes, it, is, it is difficult, no doubt. But as I said, the best piece is that you can give one exam at a time. Which is a big plus, right? So you'll prepare for three months, give one exam. Again, three months, give an exam. Again, three months, give an exam. And so on and so forth. So by the end of 12 months, you're done with the qualification, which is huge in itself, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. sir? Yeah? Sir, now I am pursuing become professional accounting second year, sir. Okay. After completing third year, can I join this course, sir? People who are in the third year, they can also join because their eligibility of course will take like three to four months of time once they have got the result. So people who are in the third year can join. Now I am uh, writing my fourth semester, sir. You cannot join. Uh, after one week, I completed my, I, I will complete my fourth semester. Then I will, uh, from June onwards, I am uh, third year, sir. No, but your results will not, the, the college will not get completed in this year. Nah? We yes, can sir, only yes. take you if your college will complete by, let's say, July, August. Yes, sir, yes, People sir. are giving their sixth semester this time, as in right now. We can certainly take them, but not, not anybody else. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Ringle, you want to ask anything, buddy? 
Hello. Yes. Yes, please. Um, I, I am uh, speaking for my son. Okay. He complete completed MBA. Okay. If he he will do this course, uh, in which departments, in which places he will get job? Actually, I I think I am thinking to send him abroad. In 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 the meantime, I learned about this course. So. If he will, if he will complete this course, in which department or in abroad, in, in which uh, uh, corporates uh, he will get job? Sure, sir. I can help you out with that, sir. I would, I would answer it into in twofold. One is which companies he would get placed in. So there are various multinationals, not only in India but also abroad, and big fours. So you would get placed in organizations like Deloitte, PwC. EY, KPMG, Grant Thornton, and so on and so forth. That's one side of it, wherein you'll be part of the big four organization. Then comes big two organization. So I was the finance head for, for Boston Consulting Group. BCG hired CPAs. McKenzie's hired CPAs. That is another way to look at it. Bain hires CPAs. That's again to look forward to. We have now coming on to um, uh, the other side of the table, we have companies like Wipros of the world, the TCSs of the world, the Reliances of the world, the uh, Infosys of the world, they all are, are US listed firms. So they need CPAs to do the US compliances and so on and so forth. So that is the industry side of it. And when I say these industries, you know, they're not only hiring in India, but they're also hiring abroad. So PwC, EY, KPMG, they hire their CPAs over here and then they send them abroad in their international entities. So that's another way to look at it. Now, which roles or which functions they would be hired for. There are three big domains in which the CPA qualifieds are being, being, being hired for. One is audit. Most of the US firms are having their audit functions uh, now being sitting out here in India. All of those audit firms, including the big fours, they all hire CPAs for the audit functions at large, which is a big time thing. The other piece is US tax. So you would see any and every company who is in US are now having their tax team sitting out here in India, as well as around the world to manage the state taxes, county taxes, national level taxes, and so on and so forth. They need CPAs to hire that. So you would see huge demand there. So tax is another domain. And then comes the financial reporting and compliances. So you would see people managing the accounting and reporting function of various US corporates who really have to manage generally accepted accounting principles of US. That is, again, the demand really plays a big time role. So uh, com companies, countries, functions, huge in terms of outreach. Does that help, sir? Does that help, sir? I, I hope I answered your query. Uh, okay. Please, uh, please ask me again. No, no. But... Hello. Well, Ringel sir, what Pankaj sir told yeah. is, uh, yeah. you, your son took MBA in, from which college? Uh, yes, sir, I'm Valley Bank. Yes, sir, I'm Valley Bank. Okay. So, uh, is his specialization fin finance specialization? Fin finance and HR. HR. Finance, finance and HR. Finance and HR. That is fine. Yeah. See, yeah. What, 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 this, what is the difference between, you know, MBA finance and this? Okay. So, ask your son to, you know, connect with me. Okay, let me go through his curriculum and then you know we can appreciate the difference. Okay, that is one way of looking at it because MBA finance he already did. Okay, we just want to yeah. look into you know, the if the program is really helpful for him. Okay, we have to look into those angles. Okay, so ask him to you know uh, speak with Priya ma'am and then connect with me. Okay, let me yeah. see his profile and then you know suggest him. Okay, it's uh, it's better to know him and then you know suggest the way forward. Okay. 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 How, can, how can I ask you, uh, contact you, sir? Pankaj, sir, uh, can you? Yeah, we'll provide yeah. you the details, sir. We'll provide you the details. Sir, excuse me? Yeah, please. Uh, how, can contact, uh, how can I contact uh, Mr. Samarada or any, hey, any staff? We'll reach, we'll reach out to you, sir, and provide you the details. Uh, okay. And one more question, sir. 
ஹலோ ஒய் திஸ் ப்ரோக்ராம் திஸ் பிஸ்னஸ் காஸ்ட்லி அபவுட் எயிட் லேக்ஸ் எக்ஸாம் அண்ட் திஸ் ஓகே sir the program fee you know it depends on the faculty we are getting in okay and also it depends on the salary the student is going to get okay two things okay uh, let us come with the package okay what is the average salary of acp the average salary of acp is 8 lakh and 8.5 lakh okay per annum okay the entire course fees is 8 lakh or 8.5 lakh okay whatever the student you know a simple we have a cpa student will earn that is the fee for them program on top of that he is going to get a degree from lagal okay so his package must be around 10 to 12 lakh okay whatever he is spending in one year he will get it in one year okay and the second thing is you know not every person can handle a cpa program okay those who completed cpa will be working top in mncs and we are buying their time okay so that and then from liba side also not only faculties there are cfos and then you know top financial managers from liba alone produced 58 ceos okay and 36 cfos in the last 10 years okay, okay. so we have our alumni pool and we will, must have their time and then you know we must bring them to the program okay so all this there is a cost in okay and what is the reward whatever you are invested the roi will be within one year okay there is a okay no? okay all together the, how much will come sir for in for the completion of this course around 8.5 lakh okay the, okay including okay. exam fees okay 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 thank you sir thank you anybody else guys anything before we really wrap up i know we are just on time anything else that you would want us to help you with i just bring in the screen guys to note down our numbers and of course the email ids and if you would like to reach out to us and we'll be more than happy to pick up your query in case that that you have do not forget that this program only has limited seats considering uh, we only uh, go with small batches not the big ones and uh, the process has already started so uh, in case you are thinking about it this is the time all right if there is nothing else guys uh, i really want to thank you for taking out time for being here and being the patient listener and uh, really want to thank you dr ram for taking out time uh, i know it's a it's an off time uh, in in chennai but really uh, i would say i'm really appreciate you taking out time for the session look forward uh, and uh, I, guys all the very best for your future in case any queries you can reach out to us and we'll be more than happy to support you in whatever way possible thank you thank you pankaj ji thank you guys for joining us this evening okay hope some thank of you. us some of you we will see in the class yeah, yeah. thank you, thank you.